Good morning, or depending on when you're watching this, good afternoon, good evening, or good night. My name's Ross, and as always told, out of voice of radio, so today we need to have a look at some pretty ridiculous Pokemon TCG bargains which have come around, and frankly, I think this is awesome. Also, it involves cloth. Which means I get to make some Santa Claus jokes. And I don't know how many of you were watching Stuttgart Regionals this past weekend. I was casting. Santa Claus did come to town. I have had a lot of fun on stream at Pokemon events. But being able to make Santa Claus jokes and chat about Claw as a genuine actual contender at a tournament. That is up there with my favourite memories I've ever had playing the Pokemon TCG. It's not that Claw. Don't even care. It is a cloth, and a cloth is better than no cloth. So let's start there with the mini tins and promo cards that have gone and been pointed out in Costco. Lovely Poketage has put me onto this. These have been spotted in Costco in the UK. Although I will say I have seen these things being made available in the US as well. So absolutely worth checking Costco in the US because this might be like a, a thing, which would be awesome. We've actually had a bunch of these repacks. Here's one which is different. It's not the same. Hence why I said it was different. Probably could have just, you know, kept it at that. But it's still one which is worth kind of keeping an eye on. Here's another one that was repacked. Again, a different one, not the same kind of thing. But these do come around every so often. And these repacks are kind of cool. Now, I will say, oh, here we go. They actually came around is last month over in the US, so there's a decent chance you might find them available here. And here's the thing, right? This is £35, and that's kind of amazing. Now, you all know Sarah says £42, including VAT. This is obviously... I mean, look, this is Costco. Now, Costco, for those of you that don't know, it's kind of designed for businesses. Now, I know it, it's weird because I know Costco do sell to individuals, but then, like, I use a wholesaler called Booker's over here in the UK that you can only get a card. You're only allowed to shop there if you are a business owner, which I am. But I had to have a meeting with the manager to prove I had a business before they let me shop there. So it, it's actually 42, including the VAT, which you do have to pay. But if you're a business, you essentially get the VAT back. Good? Excellent. So look, here we've got five mini tins. We've got four promos. And this is honestly kind of awesome. Now, these are the Gala Friends mini tins. And you'll notice you've got the complete collection. You've got the one with Pormi, the one with Pikachu, the one with Sprigatito, the one with Fue Coco, and the one with Quaxley. Yes, I know other Pokemon are featured on there. What am I talking about? Gala Friends Mini Tins. Paldean Friends Mini Tins. That's more like it. And I will say that the cheapest I can find these for online at the moment are £8.40. Which is £42.00. If you buy five of them, but you're not guaranteed all five different designs, and then you don't get the promos. So as far as I'm concerned, this is frankly a better deal. Yay! Speaking of those promos, I've already given away that one of the ones you get is a cloth. It's unfortunately not the good cloth. The good cloth is from Powder Air Evolved. This is just the regular cloth from Scarlet and Violet. I really want to say that free energy 130 is good, but the reality is getting free energy onto this fairly low HP basic Pokemon, it, it's not exactly going to be the easiest, simplest thing to do now, is it? Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> I want this to be amazing. I want this to be stunning. The reality is it's just a fairly underwhelming cloth. Uh, we've also got a Luxray there. Now, this Luxray is actually good. This Luxray has seen a bunch of play. It is a genuinely viable card. This is the one that's got Swelling Flash that you can just play it as if it were a basic, even though it's a stage two, if you're behind on prizes. And then free energy 180, but it's not really free energy. It's one reversal energy. Like that's literally the whole point of this card. You're behind on prizes, you play it down for free, you attack to reversal energy, and then you're, you've gone from nothing to attacking immediately. Did initially see a bunch of playing Gardevoir decks, because that deck plays reversal energy anyway. 
I'm telling you, I, I, like I just said, I commentated Stuttgart Regionals this weekend. So I saw a bunch of deck lists. I saw a bunch of Gardevoir deck lists. N none of them played Lux Ray. But I do think that is kind of the star, as it were, of these promos. There's also the Gyarados that came around in Powder Air Evolved. I like that it does 180 for free energy if you're behind on prizes. Incidentally, another really good candidate for reversal energy. But look, if Lux Ray's gone away, and that never really was particularly good anyway, we, we can say a very similar thing about Gyarados here. And then Orphworm. Who doesn't want an Orphworm? I love Orphworm. Is one of the coolest, po as far as I'm concerned, one of the coolest Pokemon from Gen 9. And this is one where it gets an extra 100 HP if it's got free metal energy. And then if you've got four metal energy, it does 100 plus 30 to your opponent's bench. It's not good. Let's move on. Because the other thing they've gone and made available is this for £40. 48 including VAT. Again, if you're a business, you claim the VAT back. If not, you're actually just paying 48 but you get yourself an elite trainer box, which should be over 40 on its own. And then you get two Pokeballs as well. Now here you can see, you know, and again, shout out to Poketage for showing us this. One's got Quick Ball and Great Ball. One's got Quick Ball and Luxury Ball. And there's a couple of others you can see there a little bit as well. And we've got Scarlet and Violet elite trainer boxes coming in here. And... These are kind of cool. Remember, Scarlet and Violet was when we started adding promos to the Elite Trainer Boxes. Pre-Scarlet and Violet, Elite Trainer Boxes didn't have promos. They were, frankly, much less fun. I never really bothered with the Elite Trainer Boxes before Scarlet and Violet. And then Scarlet and Violet came out. And as soon as Scarlet and Violet came out, I was like, yeah, I'm in. I'm absolutely in. I'm all the way in. This is amazing because you've got your Coridon and Maridon promos. Little bit of advice from your old pal Wossy here. The Coridon and Maridon promos are actually super annoying and awkward to get over in Japan. So, look. As it stands, these are quite readily available. They're really not that difficult to get. And remember, these are the regular Elite Trainer Boxes, not the Pokemon Center exclusive. So you get the regular promo, but you won't get the stamped Pokemon Center promo. Right? I, I get all of this. But these cards are a pain to get in Japan, which means that the price of them is going up. They were kind of tournament promos, so you had to win a little tournament. But even then, you'd only get a 50% chance of getting the one you wanted. They are way more available in the West. So if you're into these... If you haven't got them yet, might I suggest getting them sooner rather than later, because time will be running out. Here's an image on the screen of exactly what you get in the Elite Trainer Boxes. You get your dice and your nine packs and your sleeves and your energy and all of that. But then you've got your Pokeball Tins as well. Now, here's a warning from your old pal Wossy. I don't know which packs are in these. And the thing about these Pokeball tins is, and we, we've covered this on the channel quite a lot at this stage, it's a little bit awkward trying to figure out whether these are worth picking up or not. Because we don't know half the time whether these are worth picking up or not. We just don't. Because they do reprints, and the reprints have different packs in. So sometimes we get, like, I mean, we've seen Cosmic Eclipse in these before, we've seen Evolving Skies in these before, but I am not... For a second, and I cannot be clearer about this, I am not telling you that's what's in these. I'm telling you that some of these Pokeballs have awesome packs in, like the ones I mentioned. But I'm also telling you that there have been plenty around which are, let's euphemistically say, less exciting. So look, my advice to you is the same as it's been for a while now. If you pick these up, might I suggest just picking up one and seeing how it goes. Picking up one and seeing if it works, seeing if you like it. And then after that, you can actually decide whether it's worth picking up or not. All right? That's my advice here. Because what you don't want to do is pick them up assuming they've got good packs in. Then it turns out they don't. But you've already bought it and that you'll just feel silly, frankly. You will feel a bit silly. So there we go. That's the advice. I think for the price, both of these are absolutely brilliant. If you've got some last-minute Christmas shopping to do, 
over in the UK, these are available. But like I've said, these were Costco bundles. I'm not covering these in Costco at the moment because it's not terribly relevant. And actually, I'm just looking through my old files here. I'm finding that this exact thing, two Pokeballs and the Scarlet or Violet Elite Trainer Box, for $50 in the US. That was a thing in Costco back in September, actually. Basically, the UK is being a bit slow off the mark. But if you're watching this in the US, and I know I have a lot of viewers in the US, proportionally, you might be looking at this and going, brilliant, Wossy, don't care, not in the UK. Well, these bundles have been spotted in the US in the past. So might I suggest heading on down to Costco, and if you're interested in these, you may well still be able to find them. As we get closer to Christmas and beyond, a lot of stores are going to be doing Pokemon TCG bundles and bargains and things of that nature. You know I like showing you this stuff. I'm probably going to continue to do so. But hey, if you've got a bargain or a bundle or something that you've spotted that I haven't covered yet, do let me know on Twitter at the Wossy and maybe we'll feature it in a future video. For now, let me know how excited you are by all of this. Go nuts in the comment section, but be nice! And then make sure you like this video, subscribe to this channel, follow me on Twitter at the Wasi. That's where we talk about Pokemon and card games and Pokemon card games, all kinds of fun things. And please do consider checking out patreon.com slash ptcgradio, where you can support the channel, get some bonus podcasts and all kinds of fun things. And get shoutouts on the channel like the lovely UberMX, who's been a big supporter of ours for a while now and is a very lovely person. So shout out to them for the support and the loveliness. But by far the most important thing as always, look after yourselves till next time, would ya? Thank you very much for watching. My name's Ross, and you've been watching PTCG Radio.